Today we're driving with Detroit hockey legend Henrik Zetterberg, who began his NHL career in 2002, finishing as runner-up for Rookie of the Year, then went on to become team captain, and ultimately led the Wings to a 2008 Stanley Cup championship as playoff MVP. Knowing that Henrik was soon to depart Michigan and return to Sweden, I thought it only made sense to take him to do really dangerous things in Michigan in a really safe car from Sweden, the 2019 Volvo XC90. In Red Wings Red, obviously. So we're heading to the M1 concourse to play hockey at 40 miles per hour with a very valuable stick, then on to Rainbow City Roller Rink to see Henrik in old school roller skates for the first time in his life. When's the last time you're on roller skates? Oh boy. I'm kind of a little bit nervous. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Maybe I should bump up the insurance a little bit. Here. <laughs> the one I want to try is see if I can do that one where you do the, you know, you stick your foot out <laughs> and get down. Yeah, I want to see uh, you do that one. Do you call yourself fully retired or semi-retired or taking a break or very no, happy? I, I'm retired. Like I'm, I'm done. Former hockey player. That's, that's kind of hit me the other day. And did it hurt to say it the first time, or did it feel like... It's just a little different, I guess. But someone asked me, you're a hockey player? I'm like, am I? Proceed no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a former hockey player. <laughs> I used to be. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I had a good run. And... Whoa. Hi, how are you? I almost killed Henrik Zetterberg with a UPS truck. <laughs> we're in a safe car, though. <laughs> that's right. We're in a Volvo. Yeah. What was it like going into the locker room the first time knowing you weren't suiting up? And I really thought that I was that I was really gonna feel awkward and want to miss it, but it almost was a little bit of a relief, you know, coming in there because uh, every time before season starts, you, you have your thoughts, have I worked hard enough? Am I, you know, can I still do this? And, and uh, you know, coming in there was kind of, more of a piece, you know. Like you get the camaraderie without any of the stress. Exactly. I get the good, the good parts now. <laughs> I can come and go as I want, and and uh, but obviously you miss it. You miss that uh, the brotherhood, and and it's like you're married with your own place. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it's uh, it, it's been different, but in, in the same way, I, it's been better than I thought it would be. So that that's good. How are you? We're gonna go try out the skid pad. Hey, hey, how you doing? Chance. Yeah, thank you. This is a cool spot. Okay, so this is either gonna be the coolest idea ever and look like really fun on camera, or we're gonna try it once we'll again. Dude, this does not episode. work at all, and we're gonna end up just going roller skating. So I'm gonna hang out from this one. I think so, yeah. You know, this is a lot to do on, with your driving too, right? Don't worry, I've been to race car driving school, it'll be fine. Okay, so can you show us what you just told me about the stick? Yeah, I just re realized it's the stick from the final game at the Joe, my thousand game. <laughs> yeah, just add some value to it. <laughs> All right, ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, see that guy up there? Yeah. Yeah, this will be fine. Okay, ready? Is that close enough? Yeah. <laughs> oh, the camera. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to see it. You totally hit it. You crushed it, right? Okay. Okay, ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Good? That's perfect. <laughs> okay, that was three out. Yeah. <laughs> 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 So, the first couple I was going like 10 or 15. Yeah. I'm thinking, let's see if we can go faster if you want to. Yeah. All right, ready? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Sorry, I'm panicked. I think I got you too close, didn't I? <laughs> but, but I think it was the wind that kind of, it's I, hard to shoot when it goes I, so fast. Good? Yeah. Yeah, you, you can probably go faster if you want. Okay. <laughs> Got it? Yeah, got it. Coming in, I'm gonna make my turn. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that so cool? It's dumb but cool. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Why do we not have this? Somebody start running camera. We got it. That's it, we're done. <laughs> and that is what we call high production value. Let's go get our roller skate on. Here's the, the big questions I ask everybody. Uh -huh. What was your first car? Uh, my first car was uh, Saab 93. What year do you think it was? 99, 98. New car, used car? It was, uh, it was a new car. I leased it, you know, through my, my hockey team. You're a 19 year old with a lease? Yeah. Well, then I didn't think. You were basically working at that point, right? Yeah, like I was you were working. already playing yeah. hockey as a yeah. profession. Yes, yeah. That was a big moment when you got your first car. It was, uh, it was pretty exciting. What color was it? Uh, it was actually red. <laughs> <laughs> What's your dream car? Oh boy, dream car. It's, uh, probably the, the one car that I really want to have now is uh, it's an Audi RS7 Avant. Look, that's the one that I've been trying to get it here for 10 years, but you can't. Why? I don't know, they don't make them over here. So you can only have them in Europe. So. So you're gonna move back to Europe just for a car? So when I move back, that's the car. <laughs> that, 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 that. Okay, and what do you drive now? Right now, uh, the everyday car is an uh, Audi A8. That's yeah. what I... Uh, That's great. Yeah. And then we have a big Yukon family car. It's awesome. All right, so then the, the question that's at the crux of the show is, what do you think drives Michigan? For us coming here, when I came here in 22, you know, you just got... Uh, welcome the people so nice you know everyone took care of you and, and it felt like everyone was proud to be from michigan you know it was uh and now for me been here 16 years when i when i travel around uh, the u.s they ask where i'm from i say detroit you know it, it's and and, and yep. people you kind of get that oh yeah cool you know so i think it is special here and, and and I think too the sport, you know, we have so many great sports teams here, you know, going from high school, college to, to pro teams. And so we have it all. And I think sports have a, a big part of, of Michigan and, and, and uh, you know, we kind of gone through a lot of things here in the last <laughs> 10 years, 20 years, even even the time I, I've been here. It's been a cool experience to kind of gone through, you know, this time and, and, and kind of see what the changes that has been done. Wow, that's cool. With you being someone who moved here not only from a different state, but a different country, it's fun to hear your perspective. But there are moments where you don't see the sun for yeah. days. But that's that's my upbringing. Sweden. That's Sweden, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's even worse. You know, the sun goes, goes up at 9 and goes down at 2.30. Come on. Yeah, so that this is pretty good this is lovely <laughs> <laughs> it seems like especially with nfl it's you get done and you either coach or sports cast or something is hockey the same way in, in some way I, a lot of guys go that route after yeah. uh, i will be shocked if i'm not involved with hockey in, in some, some kind of form yeah. you know but for now the nicest thing that I'm doing the most is n not having to be in front of a camera or not have to be... As I have you in front of a camera. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. This is... Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, no worries. Yeah. Yeah. What's your most memorable goal you've ever scored? Oh, it's got to be the Stanley Cup. Uh, 
that final goal. Yeah, the clinching one. Even though it was probably my ugliest goal in my career, <laughs> or the luckiest goal in my career. But better be lucky than good, right? Yes. Yeah. So that that's the top one. Is the Stanley Cup heavy or not? Not really. Not not. I always me. wonder when I see when I see you guys skating with it. First off, for those of us who don't skate, <laughs> skating already looks dangerous and, and scary. And then holding what looks like a 70 pound yeah, it's not 70. silver trophy <laughs> over your head. I'm like, that looks terrible. That looks like a horrible choice. Yeah. But even if it was 70 pound, I think we would you know, lift it gladly that time. Because it's something that you're, it's so special. You want to do it again. Again and again. Yeah. The amount of factors involved, right? So like many. It's, it's so many. It, who's hurt? Who's not? Who's yeah. ready? Who's? It's so hard. So many different yeah. little pieces. Yeah. So you're really happy that you did it once. Hey guys, sorry to bug you. Do you know where that uh, indoor roller rink is? Anywhere good to park specifically? No, we're good. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, up here. All right, thanks. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. They were respectful. They didn't hit you until the end. Sorry, I had to pimp you out just uh, once just to see what happened. So, you have never roller skated? Never. Yeah, it's so weird. How about that one-legged thing you said? I hope it goes down. <laughs> I know it's possible. <laughs> Yeah, you're pretty good. Okay, now, here comes the ultimate test. I went to grab a stick. Oh, it's the one that says Zetterberg. Yeah, those are the one I play with. Enhance. Please don't go down. I'm gonna feel really bad. I think no, now it's more, more comfortable, I think. Oh boy. Right, here we go, in. Oh! Right, the old. <laughs> oh, oh, stop it! <laughs> I couldn't even come close to stopping. <laughs> right, let's see if I can get it up in the air. <laughs> GoPro check. Don't hit me, don't hit me. <laughs> I'm just the camera guy. Where was the arena? The Joe? It's down there, Cobo Center. That's pretty. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm gonna come down and roller skate though, but. <laughs> Is this not what you had planned today? <laughs> you can go, hey, let's go roller skating yeah. today. Boots are pretty cool. I kind of dig the boots. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, I almost had it. Like how do you skate backwards? This is... Oh. No, forward is better. Right. The best part is I'm glad I brought sticks because I'm basically using it like a cane. Me too. I'm way more comfortable with a stick in my hand. No! Got it. No way I should be sweating. <laughs> no, it's <laughs> not. <laughs> hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay, I think. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Thanks, dude. Yeah, thank you. This is awesome. Suburban Drives Michigan is brought to you by the Suburban Collection, representing 34 different automotive brands in over 50 locations throughout Michigan. From your first car to your dream car and everything in between, the Suburban Collection.